maybe the defending champs. You know what I mean? Like I know Brady came out and said this is this is different. You know, everyone, this is it's not the same because he's basically giving everyone a message like, let, let's not just think we're going to run it back because we got everyone back. I mean, and 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 then there's the opportunity that things can change if you get the right guy too, as we saw. Uh, you know, because we were there. We were the, we were there when I was calling Watson, Winston, and Winston Watson in the booth that day, uh, <laughs> Nate, um, and. And we were there that day, and th- that if I had told you, well, we'll put it up on the screen right here of me and you uh, having some fun before the game, but if, if somebody came up to us and said, by the way, this is where the Super Bowl is going to be next year, and uh, the yeah. Brady and the Buccaneers are going to win it, we're, we're like, what? You know what I mean? Like, it's amazing how things can turn in the league. If, if, and if my memory serves me, serves me correctly, mm-hmm. Damon Winston started that game off with an interception, I believe it was a pick six, yep. and then he ended it with an interception pick six, yes. so... Yeah. The taste in the mouths of these Buccaneers fans was just raw, and they're like, ah, we can't do this again. And we kind of knew the writing was on the wall for Jameis. But then Tom comes in and just has one of the greatest, what could have been, walk off of his career and, and right off into the sunset. The fact that he's not retiring tells me one of two things. Um, one, that he's addicted to the game. And, uh, you know, I know the word addiction has a negative connotation, but he's addicted to success, and that's okay. And then, two, I do feel like they have a chance of running it back. Like they brought back everybody. They're re-upping guys. I don't know where they're getting this money from. The coaches are getting extensions. Um, but that does lead me to one last thing before we go. I love talking yes. football with you, Rich. Um, Jameis Winston and Taysom Hill. Sean Payton, this is your life. Drew Brees is no longer a saint. The roster is still solid. I was in New Orleans uh, this past weekend with the wife, and, and these fans, like, they are ready to win. This isn't oh, let's, let's hope Jameis can be a bridge quarterback or something. They want to win now. Sure. And I do feel like because Jameis Winston will let that thing go too, let's not forget, joke about the 30 for 30, 30 TDs, 30 interceptions. He also threw for 5,000 yards. He did. You cannot laugh at that. So Jameis Winston is going to have this offense a little bit more explosive. So as, as I heard in New Orleans this past weekend with that accent, I'm ready to go, baby. <laughs> hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here. 